We all know the health benefits of juicing, but we just find it hard to start. I decided to brave it and have only juices for 10 days. Oh my God. The benefits this had first and foremost on my immune system, no colds and flus. I was exercising more and the best side effect is I lost a lot of weight, but I categorized this in colors, red, green, yellow, and I'm going to share right now all what I had the weight I lost and the experience I had for 10 days. So keep watching if this sort of content interests you. This is five days worth of juicy grocery produce to give you an idea. I've got beetroot, ginger, mint, lots of celery, lots of cucumbers, lots of carrots, some kale, some baby spinach, got pineapple, strawberry, green apples, pomegranate, apples, lemons, limes, turmeric and some grapefruit. So let's start. I can class this as juicing 101, what you need to know. I classed my juices in colors and I'm starting with green. You can see that I'm cleaning my cucumbers with lemon. You can use, um, some people use peroxide, others use bicarbonate of soda, especially if it's not all organic, just to remove all the toxins. And I used um, all the green vegetables I bought. So there was kale, spinach, and I added, added in some apples just to keep the flavor better. I always use ginger for all of my juices. And um, of course, celery, which is the main thing. It is really good for anti-inflammation. It's also good because it produces some good bacteria, which helps with your digestion and reduces bloating and would help weight loss and this was what i had for three days because i had 32 ounces a day for breakfast um yes it's, it's amazing and this is just the start of my mini juices so keep watching and um, let's learn together and see what the general effects were i like to bulk juice so the next was an orange juice made of of oranges turmeric and carrots let's talk about the benefits carrots are not only high in potassium and vitamin C, it's also pro-vitamin A with a lot of health benefits, such as improving your eyes, your skin. It's an immune booster and it could manage your sugar levels. And as well, it is said to have um, a lot of beta keratin and it could have anti-cancer fighting molecules. And for oranges, is high in vitamin C and turmeric. That's just a staple that should be consumed more. It really helps with inflammation. And, and people who've had arthritis have reported very good results. And it could improve your general mood with from depression. And more importantly, it is very good with your immune system. So this was the next juice I made. And this will take me for about two days and i was done juicing it took me 30 minutes and i'm having 32 ounces of each hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel this is the start of a 10 days juicing journey for me it's the 21st of feb 2023 and i'm in this habit of always cleansing my body trying new things and i share it with you guys so this is no different thanks again for the love the support the subscribers i appreciate you guys a whole lot i'm on a quest to get to the best i can be and i have been doing pretty well steady with my vegan and um, pursuits i've been doing a lot of raw and cooked meals so this is my breakfast it is shamefully late because i was not organized i should have done my juicing yesterday because it's almost two o'clock and this is my first meal this is cucumber it has some i always use ginger for almost all of my juices that's a bit standard so this has got cucumber it's got ginger it's got some limes and it has also got celery which is where my main green juice base because celery is amazing for you for lunch i'm going to have orange carrots and some turmeric that is just what i need and for dinner i'll have exactly the same but i'll add kale and i forgot to mention mint mint is amazing so anyway come along with me this is still day one i'm i'm going to share my progress I'm taking some before pictures it's not really to lose weight but it's i'm sure there'll be by effects and at the end of this 10 days i'll be on holiday somewhere so see you guys later
So it's day three and I'm on the green juices. I'm about to do some juices which will help with anti-inflammation and to boost my energy levels. I've got beets, pomegranate, watermelon, pineapple. That and I'll show you once it comes together. Those are my containers that came in the post yesterday. All right, I'll see you guys later. Mm. let's start with the first i'm using beets lime and ginger so the reason why i'm using beetroots is because it does help with your iron levels and i suffer from low iron every now and then it helps with blood circulation and it cleanses your blood and for ginger which i said i use across all of my juices doing research i uh, hear that it includes increases your serotonin levels and it uplifts your mood and could help depression so take notes and finally for lime it does help with chronic diseases and reduces any inflammations or swellings you've got so that's it the first of my juices next i use apples oranges pineapple ginger and beetroot we've not really spoken much about apples have we so i'll just briefly tell you it's made up of a lot of water so it's very hydrating and it could help with heart health it's been proven that it helps the way your heart functions it protects your brain maintains weight and it's a good boost in immunity pineapples as well although it's really high in vitamin c it does contain an enzyme called bromelain which helps your body to fight pain and reduce swelling so it's all great good for you the next juice was um, one pink grapefruit mint as well as pineapples Grapefruit is very high in vitamin C, so your immune system stays boosted. For pineapples, this is very similar. And more importantly, mint. I have learned that mint helps with indigestion and should help with constipation when you're on a juicing diet. So please consider that. The next recipe is watermelon, lime and ginger. Watermelon is very good for energy and this is a lot of what I need now to try to get more agile and do more exercising. And it's very hydrating as well. And you know, ginger is my staple, always goes well. <laughs> and then lime helps with any inflammations and this is my juice done. I'll put them all in containers and store them and they normally keep in the fridge for about three to four days. So it's always best to bulk juice. You take it, get it out of the way and you can just enjoy your fantastic recipes. Why not? So I color code them and I just make a note to use um, stickers to remember which is which because the colors are very, very similar. So the last of the juices I'll make today with pomegranate, apple, watermelon and ginger and pomegranate oh my god the benefits of this is it really helps if you have issues like high blood pressure or just generally cannot stabilize your sugars it is a must have in every home and i'll talk about this in a different video because it's really beneficial anyway this is it i've come to the end of my juicing on this day and i juiced my life away so let's keep watching it's day five <laughs> this is my lunch it's about three o'clock and it's a saturday we went out i'm about to cook dinner for the family it's going to be tough because i have been out exhausted all of my energy i'm about to have this water what you saw me prepare before watermelon and some lime that's it the one thing i want to say mm, this tastes so good ginger in all of my juices anti-inflammation and anti -det and detox as well feel lighter i feel better anyway i'll talk to you guys later on day seven i woke up with very high spirits not like i have low spirits sometimes but i just felt great i looked in the mirror look at my waistline oh my god this girl this girl is on fire honestly speaking you are what you eat whatever anybody says you are exactly what you consume let's go on and juice for the next three last days of this 10 days juice fast So for this, we need carrots, radish, lime, ginger, and grapefruit to produce magic. 
I know for sure that most people choose to lose weight and definitely you lose a lot of weight. This is a fat burning juice. Anybody who's trying to lose weight should try this. Vitamin A in the carrots regulates visceral fat loss, which is what I'm using. I'm using radish, which flushes your liver and kidneys and definitely helps to improve metabolism in the process. Vitamin C from the oranges is key to actually burning fat in your body if you did not know this. Ginger is said to improve fat loss. So this here is a recipe to lose weight, not fast, but effectively. So try this and thank me later. I'm on day number eight and I'm struggling today. I feel really weak. Just got back from doing my hair, my nails and you know when you've cooked good food you like <laughs> and it's time to eat it and you're so excited that's how i feel this is one of my best drinks this is the turmeric orange and carrot juice again i always put a pinch of ginger this juice is so full of vitamin c and it's really helped my skin and it does help my metabolism due to the vitamin a in beta carotene which helps you to lose weight and the vitamin c so it's really good i've got two more days to go i've already been updating but i feel really weak today and i'm missing chewing so <laughs> see you guys later just a quick update at this point for my last two days i juiced and i'm not going to really bore you guys with any more information i'll just let you see the quantity that i juiced and oh my god every Day, I tried new recipes it was more exciting and I always have to have greens so greens are a staple in the morning and the more exotic exciting juices like the orange colors and the dark reds and the light reds they kind of go in the afternoon or the yellows and this is just my produce you can see the fridge and this was my last three days oh my god I seem to like this window an awful lot hello and this is the last day of my 10 days juicing it's been a roller coaster of emotions which i've not really chatted my emotions because i've been drinking a lot of juice i've not really felt hungry but i could still update you guys more it's the last day and yeah i want to show you guys i think i showed you how i looked on the first day complete about bloating on this channel for several months and i did a raw vegan diet which helped with my bloating but it was not sustainable long term i have raw vegan days i did cooked vegan meals and i've gone on juicing and just stopping meats i think is the main thing now i don't know if it's sustainable long term but it has done me a wealth of service i've done juices to help my skin my skin feels better especially lots of carrot bitter carotene even um, celery helps to clear your skin and the main thing that i've had in all of my juices has been raw ginger that helps with indigestion and bloating which has been the reason why i look very lean i don't feel congested i don't feel like i need to go to the toilet i feel great this is my look today in terms of weight loss i've lost about three and a half kilos which i did not show because on this channel like i said i don't want to focus on necessarily talking about weight loss it's more of a general change in her lifestyle and weight loss is a byproduct of that so i feel good i just thought i'll end this vlog here um and also another thing to note if you're all dish on this channel and you watch my videos you know that i normally don't exercise but guess what since i started doing this it's helped to relax my muscle a lot of ginger does that and celery and i've been having and um, things like radish which flushes your kidney and your your liver and helps to improve metabolism a lot of cucumbers as well all of these things especially with the anti-inflammatory components like ginger vitamin c oranges um apples all of that stuff has helped my muscles so i'm able to exercise i feel better i'm not going vigorous because of my back injury that is working so making sure that i incorporate uh, raw juice every day it's not going to be obviously like just that i might choose either breakfast lunch or dinner i'll make sure that i always have fresh juices in my fridge another thing is that i've experimented a lot of stuff and i know for a fact that what always worked long term what i preach on this channel are not facts fast fixes so long term what i'll say is i'll go back to my eating 
one healthy meal a day, maybe one and a half meals, and do intermittent fasting. Make sure that for five hours, uh, eat in a day, and just keep that. Just keep being healthy. Keep my steps in. I'll uh, have raw vegan days, a lot of it, because it's helped me. I'll make sure that I incorporate that. I'll, I'll, I can always go for a system cleanse if I need to. But I just thought that I'd end this video. And thanks if you've watched up until the end. And thanks for those who've subscribed already and who've been watching my videos. I don't take you guys for granted. Let me know what you want to see next, if any, and I'll comply. But hey, I'm going to be sharing my next video, my next few videos, the best raw vegan sauces for like salads that could go with anything that's been really requested but i've not had time because i've been juicing <laughs> for 10 days so i couldn't really be preparing yummy sauces and not eat it so i'll do that next and i'm going on holidays tomorrow with the family so this body is going to be bikini rated yes get out anyway thanks again i'll see you in my next video